Now I want that drop. Yeah, now I do what I want. 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 What is going on guys? TD for 3 here and today I'm bringing you the most OP build in the game. You're pretty much going to be a demigod. This build, I love it. I use it in Pro-Am and Park. Oh my god. Let's just get in out of this. Let's get in what it is. So it's going to be a small forward and we're going to do a point forward. If you watch the NBA, you're probably keeping up with Giannis Antetokounmpo from the Bucks, my favorite player, my favorite team. You're like him, except you can shoot. You can shoot. Giannis can't shoot. So you're making a point forward, and you're going to make this man 6'10". 6'10", you're like, yo, he's going to be slow as hell, blah, blah, blah. Yo, I got the clips to show it, and you'll, get, you'll understand too once you start playing with it. So you're going to max that wingspan out, grab boards over everyone. Oh. Oh, I love this build. Wait, you're going all the way down to 200. No, you can't dunk on people, man. You can't dunk on people. Bruh. Keep saying that. Keep saying that. Just watch the rest of this video. Shoulder width. Max that thing out. Hand, it doesn't really matter. I prefer left when I'm playing. So, the number. Obviously, doesn't really matter. So, let's get in to the attributes and everything else about the build. Alright guys, for the attribute upgrades, this is my preference. I mean, you don't have to do it if you don't want it, but this is what I prefer. First thing I'm going to tell you to do, do not upgrade your mid-range all the way to the top. Leave one. I messed up. Because once, from the second to last one to the top one, it doesn't give you anything. Which is, first of all, stupid. But it was stupid by me for even doing it, because immediately after I did it, I said, oh my god, I forgot. So that's stupid. But in my opinion, you don't need shooting off dribble. You really don't need it. In the agility, I prefer, I mean, I don't. I feel like I don't need that one extra speed. I mean, the two vertical might be nice. So when I'm almost a superstar one, so when I get that, I might fill out agility. I'm not really sure yet. Defending, I don't think you need to fill it all the way up because I mean, for me, I just, I know how to defend. I'm already good at defending. So I don't need, I don't need all that stuff. The lateral quickness, having more would help. But I already get enough steals. Playmaking, obviously fully up. With speed with ball. Once you put a boost on that, it's a 96. Speed, or put a boost on this too. Playmaking, you get 87 ball control. If you're in sunset, you are speed boosting in pro and part. So it's nice. Rebounding, I left one because I'm already grabbing boards. Because of that wingspan and the badges I got. Strength right here is about good for me because I'm still bodying people up. I mean, you're going to see some of my drop set moves that I have a tutorial about. So after you see this video, you're probably like, man, I want to to do that move. Post scoring, I put a little bit in that. Three point shooting, max out. Layups and dunks, max out. You throw a boost on three point shooting at 77. You go in the corner. It's another bonus with corner specialists you're going to want to get a lot of badges i'm going to show you the badges that you should get i mean there's a lot of badges i have that you don't have to have but i mean if you can get every badge i mean might as well get it so i'm going to show you the badges right now all right guys for the badges obviously you're going to want to make sure you get your grand badge it's just going to come and then acrobat I think it's a really good badge to have. It pretty much activates every time I go up for a layup if it's contested. Dream like up and under is a nice badge to have. I have a video on that. Drop zipper, you're gonna wanna have this badge at th this build. It's OP, that move is unstoppable. I got a video on that if you wanna check it out. Post pin technician, another easy badge to get. Nice one to have. Relentless finisher, you're gonna want that every time you drive to the rack with contact, that thing's gonna activate. Teardropper, not really one that you need, but it activates more than you think on layups, even if you're not doing a teardrop. Catch and shoot is a must. Corner specialist is a must in my opinion. Deep range Jedi, I mean, it's a must too. I mean, all, all these badges you're going to want to have. I mean, they all activate. Like, pretty much everything I do, I have a badge activating, which is what I want. Difficult shots, you got to have it. Limitless range, you got to have it too. Mid-range Jedi, yup. Tireless score, of course, especially when you're playing point forward, because I play the point guard for my Pro-Am team. You're probably going to want to play on ball with this build. I mean, it's OP, and so you're going to want to have tireless score. Then obviously I got my five Hall of Fame badges. Break start, definitely a must, because you're going to be bored and you can get that ball up the court. 
Toss a rebounder. This one's a grind, but oh my god. It helps so much. My guy rebounds like crazy just because of having this badge too. Not even counting the build. Not even being 6'10 with the max wingspan. Oh, whoops. Chase down artist. Yep, you're going to want to have that. Defensive stopper. It's a grind. But you're going to want to have that badge. Pick dodger. Yep. Pick pocket. Yep. Rim protector. Brick wall. Brick wall, I mean, it's one where you might not need. You don't set a whole lot of screens. But I still set screens, especially in the park, to get my team grade, teammate grade up. So... It's good one to have one man fast break. It's going to be easy to get. Posterizer. You get big man contact dunks with this build. So posterizer. It's going to be easy to get just from doing the drop step. And you want to have posterizer. And then obviously you got all the mental badges. But yeah. So let's get into some clips of how OP this build actually is. Alright guys. So I'm going to be showing you some clips of this build. Just mm, look at them. Look at that. Look at the guy holding his knee from me dunking on him so hard. Uh, I love this build so much, man. I'm pretty much, I'm a playmaker, sharpshooter, lockdown fitter, whatever. I'm a demigod, man. Look at me knock this three down like a sharpshooter. Can do anything you want. Look at this drop step right here, like what I was talking about. Dribble, dribble, back down. Bang. All day. Oh, I love using it so much as you're going to see some passes that I make. Me breaking ankles. It can do everything i know there's been other people that have made builds similar to this on youtube and they know what they're talking about too and i love my players so much but anyway you're gonna some see some awesome clips from my guy some pro-am part clips and i suggest you make this build as fast as you can anyways i say thank you guys for all the support let's try and blow this video up a little bit and i'm gonna keep pushing videos out of you guys so td for three peace